Hi, Timothy Unkert here, and in this video, I'm going to demo initialization of a two-dimensional array in C. I've included my header file, and I have my main function. So let's initialize the array. So I'm going to make an array of type integer, and it's going to be a two by three array. And I'm going to say equals, and then we'll open it with the curly braces. And then I'll do the top uh, row, which is going to be three columns across, and then the bottom row, and the last item, I don't want to add a comma here. And then I'll go down here and close it, and I've initialized my array. Now I'm going to create two integers, i and j, because we want to print this out, and I'll format it a little bit just to show you what it looks like. So I'm going to say four i equals zero i is less than 2, i increments by 1 each time through the loop, and then we're going to go into our j loop, so we're going to say 4 j equals 0, j is less than 3, and j increments by 1 through the loop, and we're going to do a print f, and we'll pass in an integer, and then I'll do a tab character after that, and we'll pass in, well, what we'll print is the uh, array item at position i, j. And close that out. Let's close out this for loop here. And let's then, after that smaller for loop, the inner for loop, we'll do a new line. And then we still need to close out um, the larger for loop, and then at the end of our main function, we want to return zero. Okay, so let's open up a terminal now, and let's compile. Okay, and I'm just going to uh, output it as without the .c extension, and then let's run it. And there you go. There is our multi-dimensional array printed out on the screen with a little bit of formatting in between the numbers. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. I uh, hope you found this video interesting. If you did and you haven't done so already, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications. It uh, really does help the channel grow. I also want to thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a great day. Bye.